All right, guys, Rob Lewis here, and welcome back to another Match Day vlog. You join me from a very, very dark and empty crew station. It's just gone 6 a.m., and uh, we've got an away day coming up. So it's our first Premier League one since uh, since West Ham back in May. We're traveling again down to London, this time to Craven Cottage to face Fulham. It's an early kickoff at half 12, so that's why I've had to set off really early. I've got my coffee in hand, so hopefully this gives me a bit of a wake up. We'll be boarding the train in around 20 minutes. Uh, it won't take us, but it takes about an hour and 45 minutes to get down to London, so not too bad this morning. And um, yeah, I'm just hoping for a win after just what's been not a great week for Man United. Obviously the Derby loss and then Newcastle in midweek. A win today is massive, not just for us fans, but for the players and the manager. We need a real, real bounce back today. Anyway, come and join me and let's see what happens today. Guys, we just got inside. They didn't actually search us, which is a bit concerning. It's um, what you call a shared concourse, so for the Man United fans, gonna be mixing it. Let's head down here to where our, our entrance is. Right, guys, this is the away end of Craven Cottage. Craven Cottage. Two thousand seven hundred tickets today. Pretty decent views. To be fair, wherever you sat here. Oh, well. Guys, so we're going to get something to eat. The prices, I thought Old Trafford was bad. Seven pounds for a hot dog. Five pounds seventy for a bite. Guys, right. right, let's see what seven pounds tastes like. It's not bad, but it's not worth seven quid. Gone back into the dressing room. Oh, come on, Red.
across the pitch, but he's not in there, not on the bench either, so. Wires down after one minute, Varane's gone to warm up. Doesn't look great. One nil, I don't who got it. Get it! Well, they're checking it. I still don't even know who scored it. Tediousness, I'll tell you. How long does this take? Offside. Yeah. yeah. Well, I think it was it McGuire they gave offside for, apparently. Yeah. Yeah. But, uh, Nothing much more after that, though, was there, really? No. Just um, still a bit slow, isn't it? It's still a bit slow. But it's like, yeah. I think we need to quicken the pace up a little bit, quicken the passing up a little bit. Yeah. Otherwise, you know, we're just not getting anywhere. It's, it's just so slow with turgeons sometimes. It's just like, if I see us going a little bit quicker, move yeah. a little bit. There's some ideas. Bit, yeah, a bit of yeah. movement as well. Like, I know they had the ball here. Um, that's what took a minute, minute and a half before he passed the ball because there's no movement for him, you know. Yeah. It's just been a bit, it, it's an improvement. Yeah, it's starting off lively and as usual, 20 yeah, minutes in. still a few hours. It irons itself out, doesn't it? It's all a bit flat. A few long balls here, a few long balls there. Yeah. There's still a few hours where they get too much space to run. But I think on the whole, you can see that Ten hours giving them a kick up the backside. Well, they're trying, but just not enough. We need something second half, big second half. Yeah, definitely a big second half. Enjoying it? Enjoying it? Oh, it's all shy. Yeah, it's all shy. dubious, dubious. He usually loves the cameras, but he's all shy now. <laughs> all right, cheers. Thank you, no, cheers, mate. Take care. Yeah.